Office Mix is an add-in for PowerPoint that allows you to easily create engaging content with audio, video, inking, screen recording, quizzes, and more. In this tutorial, I will explain how to get started using Office Mix, how to record your mix, and lastly, I'll explain how to publish your mix to mix.office.com. Okay, let's get started. Office Mix works on Office 2013 and Office 365. If you need to upgrade your version of PowerPoint, please click this button to learn more. If you're an educator, you may be eligible to download a free copy of Office 365. Click this second button to find out more. To begin, download Office Mix from our website, mix.office.com. Office Mix is an add-in for PowerPoint. That means that after you install, PowerPoint will automatically open to reveal a new mix tab here. You will also see some helpful mix content to help you get started. With Office Mix, you can record yourself using audio and video, write or draw on your slides using inking. You can add quizzes, live web pages, and simulations. You can capture screen recordings and more. You don't even need to create a new PowerPoint presentation. You can start with one you already have, just like I'm doing now. To begin, let's start with a simple slide recording. You are now in record mode. Here you will see your slide presentation in the main body of the screen. To the right of the screen, you will see your audio and video panel, where you can select your audio and video inputs, see a preview of your video, check your volume level, and choose a pen size and ink color. Once you're all set up, Click record in the top left corner of your screen. You are now recording. Draw on your slides, trigger slide animations, and seamlessly record as you advance to the next slide. If you mess up, don't worry. Making a change is easy. Click stop at any time. Preview the recording you just created, and if you're not pleased, you can delete the recording and record again. When you're done, you can exit record mode anytime by clicking the close button. You are now back in PowerPoint's normal slide view and ready to upload and share your mix. Here you can see the inking and audio now on your slide. You can select and move the ink around the slide and scale it as needed. If you record a video, it will appear on your slide like this. You can also scale and move it around as needed. Okay, you are now ready to securely upload your mix to the cloud. Your mix will be set as private by default, which means that only you can view it. You can change these settings anytime when you're ready to share with others. Once you click the Upload to Mix button, you'll see the panel on your right open and three easy upload steps. Click Next. If this is your first time uploading a mix, you will be asked to sign in. Once you've signed in, you will need to choose to create this as a new mix or replace an existing one. If you want your mix to be viewable on a mobile device, select the checkbox here. Your mix will be saved as a video, which may add several minutes to your upload time. Once your mix has been uploaded, click the orange button to view, manage, and share your mix from the mix portal. The details of your mix will appear in a new browser window, just like this. You can add a title, description, choose a category, and create tags. Move the slider here to set the permissions you would like for your mix. Be sure to save your settings by clicking Save at the bottom of the page. There are several ways to share your mix. You can simply copy and paste the URL provided here. You can share your mix on these social channels. Or you can copy the embed code and embed your mix right into your web page. It's that easy. Visit mix.office.com slash mymixes anytime to view and manage your mixes. Congratulations! You now know how to get started using Office Mix, create a slide recording, as well as upload and share your mix. You are well on your way to becoming a mix master. Check out more tutorials and discover how mix can inspire you. Happy mixing!